Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. This is Dragonfly Gamer UK, and we are back in Icarus. Uh, we left it um, after getting rid of the fog in here, um, setting a potato in a portable hydroponics just to see if it starts growing. Temperature's okay. Um, it should grow okay here. Um, I will get a grow light in here. Help me have to get rid of those solar panels at some point. It's going to start blocking the sun. And what else did we do? Got rid of the pollution as well as the water in here, like I said. Um, Let's just quickly go outside. We build our weather station, so when that turns amber, there's a storm coming. We build our jetpack refueling unit, a pump, whatever you want to call it. And we set up our solar panels with these four IO chips and two. Daylight sensors, solar sensors. And now our solar panels are tracking the sun perfectly. And if we look, we're getting 338 and 320. I say perfectly, I expect the shadow to be. No, maybe not. Is that right? Let's have a look. Yeah, no, that looks pretty good. I do think that's pretty good tracking. So, yeah, so quite a good start actually. Yeah, what are we up to on our canister? 3,300. What have I got in mind at the moment? 900. So I think I'll swap them out um, for the time being. What I want to do today is to build another couple of um, frames here um, so I can get my tool station on there. And thanks to one of my subscribers, he mentioned, why don't I move a power unit with a battery out here so I can charge my batteries without having change my batteries without having to come into the the um inside every time so you know because the event airlock sorry and I thought bloody hell what a really good idea why have I never thought of that but instead of moving that I think I'll just move the battery charger so I think I will uh take that up there and quickly move my battery charger And that can go. Actually, I'm going to put it upside down, but I'm going to put it there for now. Actually, no. No, it can't stay there. Yeah, it'll be fine there. And then I just need to quickly connect it up. Yeah, what am I after? Um, wire cutters. Boom. And I'll stick that battery in there. And what I'll have to do is get myself a bigger battery to charge in there, which isn't a problem. So yeah, uh, thanks for that tip. That's a really good tip. I never, I've no idea why I never thought of it before. Let's turn off, save some power. And we're doing a mortar, you know what, we're here. Let's quickly quench our thirst before it becomes an issue. And quickly eat some food. And you know what? I've got a partially filled bottle. I'll swap that one out. And close and lock. They're full. So I can turn that off to save, save a little bit more power. Okay, so I want some green paint. Actually, let's just take some of this paint outside. Um, anything else I can move around? No, it'll do for the moment. Nope. Part of the problem I'm painting your hand, it thinks you want to paint everything. And I do ultimately, but just not quite yet. Um, so what I want to do is paint. Let's just swap these back a moment. I don't know if I can paint that one that's in there. No, I can't. So I'm going to have to let's just stick some of these in here for the moment. Just get out my inventory. Um, 
pick that up, drop it, and paint it. Just so I know it's my backpack, jetpack. Yeah. And then all this can just be green. Just so I know what it's for. There we go. I know that's my jetpack now. Okay, so that's that done. So what I want to do, I want to make some frames. So frames, which energy I've got, plenty. I've got steel, iron, I've got iron in here. Where's the steel? Steel is in this one, actually, so. Let's just put the gold back in there. Stick the steel, steel in there. It's actually cheaper to make steel frames than iron frames. So if we look at iron sheets are one gram of iron. Iron frames are four grams of iron. So that's five grams in total if you want a frame with one level of construction on it. Steel frames only two grams of steel. And half a gram of steel for the um, steel sheets. So that's half the cost of an iron frame. So I want to build um, a few steel frames, steel sheets. Let's just build steel sheets to begin with. I will need a steel, an iron frame for that. Actually, I've got any iron frames over here? Yeah, I have. Let's make sure that one's done. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, I think I need. I got there, one, two, three. That'll do. And then steel frames. How much gas do I have? 3,000, let's get plenty of gas left in there for the moment. And the way you can tell the difference between a steel frame and an iron frame is the steel frames are flush in the corners where these ones it looks like the bars go underneath. You see what I mean when I do this. Oop, turn that turn up. As you see that's flush. It doesn't have this angle bit in the corner. That's how you know some steel. Okay, let's just build out some more of this. As I said previously, this will all eventually get... Oh, I've got to be careful of my vent there. This will all eventually get... Um, blocked in. But I need to move them first so I can do this. I just want to move that vent. Hmm, got too much on me. Okay. And now I can put a steel frame in there. Where's this one? Where do I want to put this one? I will stick it over here for the time being, just so it's in my inventory. I don't think I've actually got enough steel sheets for these now, but... Oh, maybe I do. Yeah, I do. Okay, that'll do for now. Steel sheets can go in here. And I will quickly put my 
vent back. Again, this is only a temporary measure until I get the advanced furnace, but to get the advanced furnace I've got to upgrade my Oh, delays. Electronics printer. Electronics printer, I think it is. But first, I want my tool manufacturing. Okay. What we're doing in there. Ooh, 600. Let's check what we need for solder. In fact, let's go home and click on that. Solder, we need 350k to 550k so it's a bit too warm for that yet electrum we need 600k to 100,000k so it's a bit high pressure we need gold and silver for that one. gold and silver for that one do i have gold and silver i don't have gold but i do have silver so i have to go and mine some silver some gold sorry and the last one we'll be looking at is Invar, I believe. No, it's not. It's Constantan, which is some one uh, k to hundred k gain. It's it doesn't need to bring the temperature up. That's copper and nickel. And I don't believe we've got. Oh, I've got the copper and the nickel. And while I'm here, I'll do what I said I was going to do. Battery, battery large battery we need steel copper and steel how much copper do i have in here i thought i put the copper back in here I must have put it in here oh still not enough copper okay i'm putting copper in here Iron, silicon, no, I need copper from here. Don't think I've got enough temperature in there to smelt this. Oh, I do. So there we go. Which one do I want in that one? So that's enough. Let's build a big battery. Might actually make two of, the, two of those. Mm -hmm. Yeah, there's one. And he can go in there. Let him charge. Um, so, right, while well, that's going, I want to look at tool manufacturing. And I need copper. <laughs> Typical. <laughs> and I was going to swap that with that one. There's uh, a temporary well. I'll, no, I'll leave it in there. But what I'll do is I'll swap them and stick that one back in there just so that's charging when the sun comes up. How are we doing in darkness? I will set up a proper air vent here at some point, but I've just got to press a button. Uh, 12, 7, yeah, they're charging. Um, and I need the copper out of here again now, didn't I? Copper. Set that going, just make sure I don't. Um, uh, sorry, just can't move that thinking, What's going on there? I was looking at what I needed, but just, I clicked on that. Um, it's fine. That will just slowly build the tool manufacturing. Um, yeah, so I'm going to get a tool manufacturer built there. I will need some iron sheets for that as well, actually. And some cabling. I've got enough cabling. Uh, I'll probably need some more cabling to wire it in. Um, and I've got plastic sheets. So I should be okay with that. So, while that's running, let me just check which board I've got in here. Tracker, good. Battery's good. I need to find, find some gold, and I believe there's gold up on the hill here. 
There's some water there, I can do with that. I don't need it at the moment. Let's just... Where's that hill? That way. Here we go. So to create the Electrum I need gold. Solder is lead, which I've got, and iron, which I believe I've got. Cobalt always useful. Really, I'm after gold. Is that all the gold we've got there? Looks like it. So, quick uh, mining excursion to get some gold. So I've now got 50 grams of gold. Um, got a bit more cobalt, a bit more iron. Yeah, I've got actually a little bit more gold than I needed, but that's fine, it doesn't matter. So what I want to do is, that's still green, yeah, tool manufactory. I want to print that, build that, sorry, just, no, too far back. Just there. And I'm gonna need the copper out of here. Not good. You managed to get them just a copper um, cable. And out of here I'm gonna need iron sheets. enough and that should be enough for those and so first things first iron sheets and welder cable coils plastic sheets and welder and then the screwdriver and there's our tool manufactory wire it in so what can we build in here so you can increase uh, improve your um, backpacks and things or your, your jetpack and suit and things later on when you've upgraded this to the uh, higher level or level 2 and what I'm looking for is you can build a pneumatic dry mining drill copper steel and solder okay so I'm going to solder yet um, don't forget plant scanner that's the normal mining drill we've got um, so once you gain once you've created it you can build better drills um, but what I could do with is the arc welder at some point we need steel electrum inborn solder so um, that just means you use batteries rather than gas for your uh, welding of these plates together it's better obviously you don't have to worry about gas then um, terrain manipulator so that means you can fill in holes and things which is useful when you have an amy you need the dirt canister to use that. Um, like I say, you can upgrade bits later on. We haven't got the um, equipment to do so. We don't have the parts. We don't have the print at the right level to do that yet. What I do want is a mining backpack. I need iron. Iron in here. Iron 19 grams. Which irons in this one? 16 grams I should take from this one. Oh, just eject it again. Stupid boy. So, yeah, build the uh, mining backpack.
this can now go in our backpack and gives us a load more spaces for storing our mined ores. And then similarly, I can get a... Oh, did I want the hard mining backpack? No, that required any bar. I thought there was another backpack in must have to wait and it's upgraded before you can get the other hard pack, which allows you to increase your storage generally. Yeah, yeah, it's not there yet. But to upgrade everything you need the electronics printer upgraded with a mod kit and that requires electrum, constantan and solder which is why I've been going to get some gold. Um, iron and solder, uh, iron and lead sorry, so there's our lead, there's our iron, there's our gold, silver, copper and nickel. So what temperature do we have? We have 615 degrees at 11.2 megapascals. So again let's just look see which one we want. That's too low temperature for that one. Um, electrum. Yeah, we're getting at the temperature range for that one. Just need to bring the pressure down. So what pressure are we at? 12, well, 11.2. So let's vent that. And while I'm doing that, I'll also bring the temperature down a bit. Or maybe it's not. Five, just let it go till it gets down to about two megapascals. Obviously, as the pressure drops off, it takes longer to uh, drain. Well, it's doing that. I'm hoping I've got a charged battery there. Yes, I do. What a wonderful idea. Yeah, we go, we're down to just under 2.4. What's the temperature at? 610. Now I believe if I stick the, let me check, it is gold and silver. If I stick the gold in, uh, close that. It should bring the temperature down. There we go. But it's also put the pressure up, so. Spend a bit more of that pressure. Problem is when I put silver in, it will send the temperature up. But will it send up enough? So why is that not made gold, silver? Let's check the pressure. 600k. Oh, it's got to be above 600k in the money. <laughs> for some night. Okay. I think I put a load of oxygen in uh, oxide in last time and not enough. That pushed the pressure right up again. So let's vent the pressure. Should get a green light soon. Button should go green. There it goes. Eject. And there we have our. I'm going to stick it over here at the moment, just keep it safe. There we have our electrum. Our solder requires a much colder temperature. Three hundred and fifty to five fifty, and we're currently at eight hundred. Let's go and sort out our hydration. Again, oxygen low. Okay, 
close and lock. That's filled up so I can turn that off. And pinging away nicely. Ooh, how are you doing? You're growing. It's growing moderately well. So what temperature is that? 691, 690. What temperature do I need for solder? 1 to 100 megapascals. I'm recording at 1.26. What I could do is, unless I've got one already. No. I don't need power over here, do I? I could bring power in from there. Um, Wrong printer. That's all I want. Oh, God, no iron, gold, or copper in there. Gold and copper. And I need some pipes. Are there any pipes on me? No, they must be inside. Typical. So what I can do is attach an active vent and run some. I don't have enough cabling here. Probably is not. Just enough, look at that. In, turn that on. That will suck air in, the cold air in, and bring the temperature down. I put the pressure up, there we go. So now we are at 1.3 megapascals at 476k. So I should be able to do The solder. There you go, green light. There's a the solder. Stick that in there. The last one is um, Constantan. Constantan, which is 1k 20 to 100 megapascals, copper and nickel. So that's an easy one to do. So um, I just want to vent that. I don't want all that cold air in there. And when I'm here, I want to look at the CO2 filters. The old one just away for the moment. It's exhausted. What are we at? What'll do? And now I need one, 
two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight of those. Three, four, four of those. Let's see if we can get the pressure up to twenty megapascals. What at the moment? Ten point nine six three. And the sun's coming up, so by the time I put the copper, here we go above 20 megapascals, and the nickel in. There we go, and now I want to. Uh, in some of that gas. So it's got a lot of pressure and temperature in there, though, isn't it? Okay, so we have Constantine, we have Electrum, and we have Solder. These all want to go into the electronics printer, so I can pick. Electronic printer mod and set that going. What have I got over here? So I'm going to need some more iron. Let's close the handle for now. Let's keep an eye on the pressure, make sure it doesn't go too high. Might as well make use of this furnace while it's going. To silicon. Now that two grams of ore there and nickel, I don't need to worry about too much. There we go. Let's do them while I've got the temperature and pressure in this furnace. How's our battery doing? Uh, we're holding our own at the moment with the battery. I could do with a few, uh, with a couple more of those solar panels, um, and replace some of these flat ones. I can't do that while the printer's running though. I knew some night race somewhere up there. I missed it. What am I huffing for? Turn that off, save it. Turn that off, save it. Going poorly. It's growing at least. Just grabbing a few bits from uh, inside the base, then, while our printer is nearing completion. Air tank low. And there is our printer mod. So, what we need, I believe, is a screwdriver. On the printer, and we now have a upgraded electronics printer. Oh Christ! I left my vent on. Jesus.
What's the pressure like in here? Okay, not too bad. It's actually brought the temperature down a bit, which is not too bad either. Um, growing moderately well. Okay, that's growing. Remember to turn the vent off. Okay guys, I think I'm going to leave it there for this episode. Um, we've got our tool manufacturer set up. We upgraded our printer. Uh, we made some electrum in our electrum, constantan and solder, which allowed us to modify our printer. We can now, if this seems to change a little bit, the buttons and things have changed. And um, we can now um, start modding our other printers. So like the um, tool printer, might as well set that going. So all four of these printers can be upgraded. But uh, so thanks for watching, guys. Um, I'll see you in the next episode. Dragonfly out.